Say, man, who's that cat coming down the street? I don't know, but it sounds to me like that wicked man with the bone. Sure have himself a ball. <laughs> Welcome back to Messing Television. I'm Bailey. And I'm Jacob. The trivia question for today is, who was the father of Cleopatra's twins? A. Cleopatra. B. Lazaro Bronco. C. Mark Antony. Or D. Seth Bow. Again, the question is, who was the father of Cleopatra's twins? A. Cleopatra. B. Lazar Bronco. C. Mark Antony. Or D. Seth Boo. And now over to Bailey for some world and local news. But first, a few words from this week's sponsor. Today's Mustang Television was brought to you by Propane and Propane Accessories. Over to you, Bailey. Electric shotgun spiked with me metal batons and leg and neck sh shackles are some of the torture devices being made and exported by Chinese companies to other parts of Asia and Africa. Trade and tools of torture seem to be flourishing with 130 Chinese companies that are producing potentially dangerous law enforcement equipment. The death toll of Ebola in West Africa is now above 2,800 with about 5,800 cases confirmed as of Monday in six months. 337 healthcare workers have been infected and more than half have died. On Tuesday, when a visitor to a zoo in New Delhi, India, jumped into an enclosure with a white tiger. The tiger mauled the visitor to death. The victim was 19 or 20, male and from New Delhi, according to the police briefing. Now over to you, Jacob. New show premiered Monday the 22nd called Celebrity Name Game with Craig Ferguson as its host. The celebrity hacker has officially uploaded photos of his or hers 22nd victim. Kris Jenner is divorcing Bruce, which are the Kardashians' parents. Top five movies this week are, one, Maze Runner with $32.5 million. Two, A Walk Among the two stones, Tombstones with $13.13 million. This is Where I Leave You with $11.86 million. No Good Deed with $10.2 million. And Dolphin Tale 2 with $9.01 million. Top five songs this week are one, All About That Bass by Megan Trainor, two, Shake It Off by Taylor Swift, three, Anaconda by Nicki Minaj, four, Black Widow, Widow by Iggy Azalea featuring Rita Ora, and five, Bang Bang by Jessie J, Ariana Grande, and Nicki Minaj. Today is Elephant Appreciation Day. While there was a spell bowl practiced in RTI Tuesday, there will also be a spell bowl practiced today in RTI. Box Tops for Education is being sponsored by the Box Tops for Education is being sponsored by the yearbook department, so bring in any box tops you can. Yearbook is selling extra yearbooks at lunch on the 25th and the 26th. These yearbooks will be from, for $45, the 2012 and 2013s, and 2000 and 2009 and 2010 will be $20. This year is also needing, oh, oh I can't read. Okay. Yearbook is also needing to get some photos from the kids that went on the German exchange, so please bring in some fo photos. In honor of College Go Week, Indiana State is waiving the application fee for the entire month of September. The homecoming dance is in two weeks, so be ready to boogie. 
Boys and Girls Cross Country got second place at the North Vermilion Invite. Individual for boys, Ben Payton got third and Caleb Phillips got ninth. Individually for girls, Morgan Grubb got second and my all-time favorite cross country runner ever, Bailey Hoffa, got eighth. Cross country will also be at Ben Central on Saturday. Tennis lost against Seeger last night. They will play again at the Danville Tennis Club on Saturday. Football will play against Seeger tomorrow night. Varsity Volleyball will play at Crawfordsville tonight. They will also play Attica on Saturday. The answer to today's trivia question is Mark Anthony. That's all for today, guys, so see you next week. Bye. I'd like to remind you that today's Mustang Television was brought to you by Propane and Propane Accessories. Turn down for what? 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 Turn down for what?